we will get this thing started. All right, guys, happy Wednesday and welcome to our glance behind the scenes. I'm excited to talk to you guys tonight and I hope to keep this to 30 minutes so I won't take up too much of your time. But I know that, you know, it's one of those things you can see the, you can see the information and you can, you know, get all these questions, but it's like, okay, like how does this all work and what do we do? And is this something that I want to do too? So I put together just a little presentation for you guys so you guys can get the rundown here. So welcome to our little group. I want to start by just giving you a little introduction to who I am because all of you who are watching this live and I'm sure those who watch the recording, I've met through social media. So I don't have that background of knowing you all my lives, but that's what I love about this business is I have had the opportunity to connect with women from all over the United States and Canada and the UK. And it's because I'm able to share what I do, who I am all through social media. And I find it an incredible blessing. Um, but who I am now is not where I was before and a half years ago when I started this journey. Um, before I became a coach, um, and still now, I'm a mom. Um, I actually went to school to get my degree in finance and accounting. So people will sometimes laugh that I actually used to be a super regimented type A accountant. And whenever I left that career, I seriously think I just threw my hands in the air and was like, I've been so scheduled and so on point for so many years that I needed like a little bit more relaxation in my life. Um, but that was my background. I got my CPA um, right after I graduated from college. So I'm also still a certified public accountant. And I had that role along with the mom role for about two years. Um, whenever I became pregnant with my second child, we had a you know sit down discussion and I really struggled going back to work with my daughter. Um, if you're not familiar with the public accounting world, I worked really long hours. So I was you know used to working 50, 60, 70 hour weeks. Um, I would go months with pretty much seeing my daughter on Saturday afternoons and Sunday afternoons because I worked evenings, I worked weekends. Um, I commuted to the city from where I lived. So it was about an hour each way. So I was drained. I was exhausted. And we made the decision to get rid of my very successful career from an income standpoint and become a single family family household. So um, we left that behind. We, we did all the things that we could possibly do. You know, being the accountant, I made my spreadsheet and I was like, okay, like, what is the bare minimum that we need every single month? And I became a coupon cutting queen, um, ditched everything that we didn't need. Um, we sold my car and I took on my husband's and then he drove a work vehicle. And we really just realized that this was, this was worth it. These sacrifices were worth it to be home. So when we had our son, I then became a stay at home mom, which was a far cry from the, the role that I had in my children's lives prior. And honestly, I struggled. Um, I struggled without having my me time, my independence that, you know, getting up, getting dressed, going into work every day. And while I loved being a mom, the adjustment was really hard for me. And I still remember going to a neighborhood um, jewelry party. And I remember coming home in tears. And my husband's like, what's wrong? And I was like, I couldn't buy anything. Like, we have no money. And I sat there with all our neighbors as they they went through all this jewelry and they were like, I want this one and this one. And I just sat there like embarrassed that I couldn't buy a pair of earrings and support this neighbor of mine that was creating her own business because we had no money. And I hated that feeling. I hated feeling trapped. I hated feeling that if we had an emergency, I couldn't do anything about it because we were so limited. Like we would float paychecks. So it's like, okay, well, our mortgage gets paid here. So I need to like make all these payments, like jigsaw puzzle just to make ends meet. And it stressed me out. And honestly, when I actually stumbled into the opportunity, it wasn't for a business. I was kind of just going down this path of like, well, I you know, not that I lost my job, but I gave up my job. And then we didn't have, you know, any spare income. And I didn't like where I was as a person. Um, I was, my son was eight months old whenever I first joined my, my challenge group where my coach said, here's our challenge group. And I was like, no, thank you. I just wanted this bag of Shakeology. Like, I actually don't want your challenge group, but she added me in anyways. So I ordered my challenge pack from her um, as a customer, wasn't a coach, and I actually canceled the automatic shipments that come with the challenge pack. I was like, I don't need that. I'm not going to order this again. There's no way that this is as good as you tell me it is. I'm going to return my Shakeology. I'm going to keep these workouts, and this just gives me something to do at home because I can't leave my house because I have kids all day. And that was my mentality going into it. So I canceled it all, and then... I didn't even participate in the challenge group for like the first week. And I watched these girls supporting one another. And I'm like, 
what are they doing? Like, they don't even know each other and they're cheering each other on. Like, this is crazy. And I watched, like, I saw myself changing and I saw how I actually like the Shakeology that I thought was going to be awful. And I saw that this whole thing was working. Like, this whole, I'm going to do fitness with support and nutrition, like that combo actually worked. So it was on day 16 of the 21 day fix. And I was like, I can't go without the Shakeology. Like I have Crohn's disease. Um, and I saw that my symptoms were, were diminishing. And I was like, I feel like this has something to do with it. Like I'm eating better than I've ever ate before. And I, I knew that the, that disease was something that could be somewhat monitored by what you, what you were doing with your body, but I never really explored it before. And I remember my husband being like, so buy more. And I was like, we have no money. Like he still to this day can't even log into our bank account. Like he's clueless. He's just like, tell me what I can and cannot do. And he just goes, I'm like, I want it and we can't afford it. And I knew that I could get the discount. So I was like, okay, if I get the discount and I can help three people do this with me, then we'll just like, that'll cover the cost. Like it's a win-win. So I sign up with a discount coach. Um, again, I hadn't even finished around the 21 day fix yet. I still remember being on the phone with my coach being like, I want that discount that you talked about. That's going to save me 15 bucks. And I think I can make this work at least one more month while I try to find other people to join me. And I quickly reached out to my sister-in-law who I had a baby the same time I did my sister who was deployed at the time. Um, and I was like, she needs the nutrition. Like her nutrition's on the ship is awful. And I began to think of people who could benefit from this. And I got three people and it covered the cost of my Shakeology. And I was like, huh, there's something to this. And like I told you, I was pretty used to working long hours. I had been almost out of it for a year now, but I had the work ethic. And I was like, you know what? I started watching my coach once I signed up. Even though I signed up as a discount coach to start, she put me in her team page. And, and, and then I was watching these people's stories and I saw their income progressions and I saw their successes. And I was like, there's nothing that those women have that I don't have. So I'm going to just go for it. And I jumped in with two feet four and a half years ago with the mentality that I could do everything I saw everyone else doing because I was going to follow the leader. They were successful. So, and they shared, you know, that's the one blessing we have with our incredible team. The information's out there. You have to just do the work. And I was like, okay, I'm going to give it one year. I'm going to go all in for one year. And like, what's the worst that can happen? I get in really great shape. I cover the cost of my Shakeology. I build. Brooke, I'm going to meet you. And that's what happened. So I was very blessed that um, I, I had that mentality from the beginning because I am still here four and a half years later. We are, and I had a typo. I thought I fixed this. We are a six star diamond elite coach. Now um, we've been elite for the last three years, which just means we're in the top like 0.01% of the company. What that means to you is we're growing. We're, we are a team that is growing. Um, we've continued to grow and it's because of incredible people who join us and the training and the mentorship that we provide along with that. So there's just a couple of pictures of my little munchkins that help motivate me every single day to just keep on going. Move this down. Um, so who are we as a coach? Um, you'll hear me say influencer. You'll hear me. You'll hear me also say coach. And it's the two that go hand in hand. We're coaches. We don't have any personal trainer certifications or nutrition certifications. Um, so I really feel like influencer gives it a better all around description because you don't have to have any of those accolades. You don't have to have, I, I have, I have a background in finance and accounting. I don't have a background, anything related to personal fitness or nutrition or anything like that. But what happened was I got this belief in these products. I saw that what I was doing, not only did I love it, but it worked. It worked for me and I knew it could work for other people. So as an influencer, what do I do? I shared it. Just like when you go to a really great restaurant and you have a really great experience, you go tell your friends about it. That's what we're doing here. That's what we're doing. The difference is these products are buying from you, not Amazon, not Target, not a restaurant. It's coming from you. So you are an influencer when you have that belief in the products that you're talking about. And we do this through our social media. You can absolutely do this word of mouth. Um, I have one of my coaches, she does everything just via personal interaction with people she sees, which is totally fine. Um, but I will say if you want to really grow and influence other people and grow your business, social media is where it's at. And it gives you that ability to share with the world all at once. Like your reach is limitless and you give other people the opportunity to know that what you're doing, what you love, what's working for you, that they can come do it too.
So what we're doing is we're on our own journey and we're helping other people realize that what, what we do, they can join us as well. And then we're going to help them along the way. And that's like the quick rundown of what, what we do. I know it's real brief, but you're, you, like I said, you don't have to have any certain background. I don't have a, a degree in beach body coaching. Um, I don't have a, a degree in fitness or I had no idea what social media was guys. Like I had a Facebook account that I would put pictures on like every four, six, eight weeks of my children with no value added. I just threw pictures up. I didn't use social media, but I saw that I could use this to build a business. And when I was like, okay, this is on my terms when I want to do it. However many hours I want to put in, I can work 10 hours a day. I can work one. I can work zero. It was my terms, my business, but I had the opportunity to influence so many people. So you're just an influencer, a coach, you're an everyday person who have a passion for something. And in our instance, it's a passion for serving other people and for sharing our journey with the other people. So we do partner with Team Beachbody. So Beachbody does the programs, they have the products. We're independent coaches. You become your own CEO, you have your own business, your success is on you. You have your own business. We have the luxury of being partnered with one of the most amazing health and fitness companies out there. Um, you've, you know, some of you I know have already done some products and some of you haven't done anything yet. Um, the most popular one that most people are aware of is Shakeology. And yes, that is our biggest one, but it's not the only one we have. Like so many people get confused or just misunderstanding, I think, of what Shakeology is. Um, but know that your Shakeology isn't your typical thing you can go grab at GNC or Walmart or even order online from somewhere else. Shakeology is not formulated to be a protein shake or a weight loss shake. Yes, it has protein in it. Yes, it can help you lose weight, but it gives you the nutrition you can't get from other foods. It fills the gaps that every else pretty much has and if you don't have those nutritional gaps you're probably making your own superfood smoothie at home that's costing you way more than if you would use the Shakeology so keep that in mind it's all about the quality of the ingredients that you're getting and we take so much pride in where we get our ingredients like if you see other companies the one thing that sets us apart is we go out like and there's videos that will show you the research on this but you know, like we go get these superfood ingredients directly from the source, directly from the countries. Like there is a man, his name's Darren Oleen, and that is his job with, with Team Beachbody is to find the source ingredients in their most purest form. And that's what we use. So it's the quality, the quality control that goes into it and the quality that you're getting that you're putting in your body. But that's our main thing, but that's not the only thing. And honestly, when I started, that was, I'm like looking at the other things I've listed out here. That was what we had. Shakeology and fitness programs, but we have expanded far beyond that now. So we have a full performance line. So if you or someone you know is super into their fitness and maybe they don't want, for whatever reason, the Shakeology, we have a pre-workout, a during workout, a post-workout, a creatine, a nighttime recover. Like that's all in this performance line. I use the pre and the post-workout. My husband uses the full line. Just different goals, different level of fitness. Um, but we have so many other options now that aren't just, okay, if you don't want Shakeology or you can't have it because something's in there that you're allergic to, like there's so many more options, not only that you can use, but that you can help other people with, with whatever their goals are. Um, we also have boosts. I use the Power Greens and the Digestive Health Boost in my shake every day. Um, the Power Greens is awesome if you're like, not a big greens fan, like not just spinach, spinach, kale, celery, but I don't know if I'm missing other greens, um, but it's a powdered green blend. Um, and it just gives you an, it's just that an extra boost, extra nutrition. Um, the digestive boost, if you have any struggle getting additional fiber in, um, they, they came out with this boost. I think it was two years ago now. And just because of my Crohn's disease, like sometimes I struggle with fiber foods that they just don't always agree with me, but this is really easy on my stomach. So this is something that I add in every day as well. And then there's a the focus energy. So if you don't really drink coffee or other caffeine, but you wanted a little boost, that's another product that we have. There's the three day refresh. It's an amazing three day plant-based cleanse. So, you know, it's something that I do after a vacation or after a holiday. Um, if I'm getting ready for a trip and it's, you know, at the beach and I want to look good when I get there, um, whatever it is, 
three-day plant-based cleanse that's designed to kickstart your, you know, kind of give you a fresh start and then like either kickstart your journey or help you kick a sugar cycle. Like I know for me, like I get stuck in sugar cycles. Like the more you have, the more you want. And if you're on that like repetitive cycle, this is something it's three days, it's quick. And it really just helps reset your body in a natural way where you're not just juicing or starving yourself. You're eating, you're just eating a very specific plan that helps you reboot your body. And then there's also a 21 day ultimate reset. So kind of like three day refresh, but it's a 21 day long program and it takes you through different phases of eliminating different foods. Um, and it is great if you have an injury or you know you have a, a good amount of weight to lose and you wanna start with this without the fitness aspect of it, that's a really great program as well. Beach Bunny On Demand is our Netflix of fitness. We do still have some DVD programs, but honestly, we're not producing any more at this point. So getting up with the 20th, 21st century? I don't even know if that's right. 20th, 21st century, whichever one it is. Keeping up with 2018. I don't even know what year it is. Gosh. Um, anyways, um, everything's on BOD now. You can stream it from your phone, your laptop, Apple TV, Roku, Amazon Fire Stick, a smart TV. If you can download an app to something, you can put Beachbody On Demand on there. Um, and then this, this is where all our new programs are going. So for instance, we have so many things coming out on um, Lift 4, which has been in the pre-launch phase on BOD right now. It will come to the BOD library on, on October 1st, and we also have a program, it's called Mas de Mes, de Mas, Mas de Mes, it's our first Spanish speaking program, um, that also comes to BOD 10-1, and then Shift Shop, which was a program that came out last year, I was actually in the test group for that one, amazing program, three weeks, um, it's, it's designed to be a rapid results program, really great, they revamped that, and they're adding some additional content, and that content will all go loaded into BOD October 22nd, so like, there's just constantly new stuff added. And when you get Beachbody On Demand, you're getting all of that stuff in there. Like all the programs that have been released over the last 20 years, they're all already in there. Um, we have our beach bars. Those just came out this year. They're great little snack bars. I'm a big snack bar person. I used to keep Kind bars and RX bars in my purse until I realized how much sugar is in them. Even though an RX bar, if you're familiar with them, you can look at the front and it's like, you know, four egg whites, six almonds, you know, two dates, like super clean. It's, it's not that, but when you look at the sugar content, it's really high. Um, so depending on what, you know, like if there, it, we have a chart that compares them, but it really opened my eyes to different labels that I didn't necessarily read the same way. Um, so our beach bars were designed to be an all around balanced snack bar. So they're lower in sugar, higher in protein, lower in carb than other comparable snack bars. Um, so those came out this year. And then to be mindset has been rocking everyone's world with a nutrition focus other than the containers. So the containers are great. Um, I started with the containers. I, the containers work for me, but they're also restrictive and it's harder to, you know, live that balanced life. If you feel like you're constantly cheating on the containers. And I, I found that just different things work better for different people, but I really think that the containers work great for some. And then 2B Mindset gave a overall nutrition mindset focus, not so much a fitness, here's your plan focus. And that program came out this year as well. Um, Daily Sunshine, I didn't have that list of their Daily Sunshine's the shake my kids have every single night with dinner. It is pediatrician approved, fruit and veggie, smoothie blend, organic, non-GMO, all those stamps that people, you know, that they market it as like the picky moms or picky, picky kids, pick your mom's choice because it, it, they went through the quality standards to get that like approved by everyone. And honestly, my kids are, well, my daughter is probably one of the pickiest eaters out there. Oh, she's still up. She probably hears me, but she loves, she loves daily sunshine. And I'm like, you know what? This is one of those things. Like you pay for the quality you're getting. And I'm like, to give her this every night and stop fighting to, to eat the you know broccoli or green beans with dinner has been a huge win for us. Um, moving on just to what is a coach, guys? You're just someone working on, on yourself. That's the biggest thing. Um, everyone, like I hear the objections, I'll go into this one in another slide, but I think it's easy to get a pre, like a misconception of what you have to be to be a coach. It's you sharing your journey, helping other people. Like that's the easiest way I can do it. If you're willing to commit, to yourself and to share that with other people, that is what we do. And 
I mean, that's, you're getting in really great shape. I mean, how can you even argue? It's like the ultimate source of accountability. I know for me, I always think to myself, like, if I didn't feel obligated to post in my challenge group that I worked out today, I totally can it, but I don't. And once I do it, I'm like, I feel so much better now that I did that. But I needed that extra little push to get it done and make it happen. Um, we support our people through our social media posts. That's the, the one main way. Um, I can't tell you how many people will say to me, you know, I needed your post today or I needed those words today or seeing your workout made me want to go work out. So some of it's through that, that public social media aspect. And then the other part is it is through the online challenge group. So both of those play a role in, in how we are able to support other people. And because of BOD, we're able to match people up with whatever program is going to work for them. There is a little, like, there's different filters you can use on your BOD where you can say, like, I want cardio, I want weight, I want 30 minutes, I haven't, like, whatever it is. And at this point, I've done nearly every program, so I can pretty much help you figure out where to start, what to do next, or if you have someone who's like, my gosh, like, my mom wants to do this, what should I have her start with? Like, can walk you through all that stuff because I've been doing it now for so long. And it just comes down to you leading by example. Like, you be willing to do the programs, to use the products, to show other people and invite them to join us. That's the bread and butter of what we do. And then we build a team of other people who want to do it too. So it's you doing it and then you finding other people who are like, you know what? I love it. This works. And let me bring other people on board with us. Um, I've talked about this a couple times, but common misconceptions, you're not a fitness expert. That's me. I am not a fitness expert. I am not at my goal weight right now. I don't know about you, but I fully enjoyed summer. 100%. I have no regrets. We enjoyed nights outside with our neighbors. We enjoyed dinners out. We went on vacation. But that was my summer goal, was just to be balanced. I'm ready now to reel it back in and recommit um, to my personal journey. And I actually, if you've been following along, I was selected to be in the Transform 20 test group with Sean T. So that'll be something I'll be able to share with you guys as I'm going through it. But I'm ready to get back into it. But right now, I'm absolutely not at my fittest weight that I've been as a coach. But that's okay. Because that allows people to see that I'm a normal person that I'm not perfect, that I have ups and downs and highs and lows, but because of this business and the accountability that it provides for me, I don't ever stop. I keep going and keep doing the best that I can in the season of life that I'm in. And I think that has to be one of my absolute favorite things about what we do and helping other people realize that you don't have to be at your goal weight to do this. You just have to be willing to be your best every day and show up. Um, it does, it's okay if you're shy. I can do way more sitting behind this computer screen than I could sitting face to face with someone. And things have changed a little over the years as I've talked about it more and more. But I still remember after signing up as a coach, being at a neighborhood thing, and someone's like, So what are you doing now? And I'm like, I don't know. Nothing. Like I was like so shy to talk about it in person because I didn't want people to think that I was going to go sell them something. I'm like, well, if they know I'm a coach, they're going to be like, Oh, well, she's going to sell us a product. And I didn't understand it at that time that it wasn't about selling it, that everyone needs to know I'm a coach because I want them all to know that if they need something, that I can help them and that they can come to me and that my door is open and I'm not going to sell you anything, but I'll be darned if you tell me that you have a goal, I'm going to try to find what I have that can help you reach it. Um, something that I did in the beginning is, is worried so much about what other people would think and that's something I had to teach myself that it didn't matter because what I do allows me to not only lead as an example for my family, um, to show my daughter about being a strong woman and being confident in the skin, no matter what size I am. Um, but it was something that was providing for my family. She sees me working, but she also sees me in her library. You know, yesterday I got to volunteer at her library at school, but she knows I work. She's upstairs in bed. She's like, when are you done? Can you come give me snuggles? She knows I'm working, but she knows what I'm doing is a different kind of business. And I love being able to show her that. So it doesn't matter what the random person on social media would think about what I do. That I post my fitness and my nutrition online and then I'm helping other women and I'm building this team. And it doesn't matter what other people think because the people closest to me know that this is something that's gonna help them. And when I'm able to help other women get that same realization and they begin to build their business and they have those same you know, turning points in their lives, I'm like, I'm doing my job. I'm sharing it, I'm inviting people to learn more, and they're having those same aha moments that help them realize that this business is an incredible blessing. Um, 
And if you're thinking to yourself, but I'm just not that interesting, you'd be surprised what people are interested in. They just want to know that they're not alone, that they're just like you. They have the same thoughts, worries, concerns, habits, weird things, whatever it is. Like today I had posted about my, my luggage from my trip last week still sitting on my bedroom floor. Like I haven't unpacked, I haven't unpacked it yet. You know how many people are like, Oh my God, like go unpack that now. Or Oh my gosh, the same thing. Like I never unpack my suitcase. I just keep pulling all my clothes out of it. Like that's so random, but people talk to you about it. Cause once they know you, they talk to you like it's a friend. So you don't have to have any interesting, crazy things. You just have to be willing to share, share day in and day out. A um, little bit about the money, honey. Um, I shared earlier about helping three people. That's all I needed to do in that first month. Helping three people was going to cover the cost of my own Shakeology. That was enough to open my eyes to, okay, well, three covers it. What's six do? Okay, what's nine do? Okay, what if I get other coaches to do this too? Three people each month, though, that's your baseline. It's your baseline. If you can help three people each month, that covers the cost of your own product. Everything over that is just your extra, extra money. You're getting 30 free meals a month with your Shakeology. And then you're getting a 25% commission off everything else that you sell. Challenge packs are a little bit higher. They're like 35, 40% is what a challenge pack gets you. And then other orders beyond that are 25%. The business is going to grow. Yes, you'll get commissions, anything you sell. The business grows as you bring coaches on board. So it's like, calling your best friend and being like, I'm going to do this. You need to do it with me. I don't know what I'm doing yet, but let's figure it out together. Um, you're, you know, like the people who are closest with you that you can really like be straight up and honest with. And that's where the business side really grows. Um, we do different, there's different monthly incentives, some things from Beachbody. Um, for example, if the first month that you hit success club, which is helping three people, the first month you do that, you get a hat super cute hat. Um, if you do it for three months before the end of the year, which you guys have time to do that, you get, I think a tank top, it's like a team beach body tank top. So like they're always sending out different things. I do different things. Um, last month on my team page, I did these little ring lights for your phone and I did necklaces like based off of how many people each coach helped. Um, so there's always little things. Um, we have different incentives from a trip standpoint. Um, the retreat that I hosted last week was our leadership retreat and that was to anyone who advanced to Diamond in the last year. Diamond sounds super fun and fancy because who doesn't love diamonds? Diamond's totally doable. I did diamond in less than three months from when I started. People do it way faster. People do it way longer than that. It's helping 12 people. And we can talk, you know, we'll talk more about that, but I just want to put that on your radar that all of you, totally possible to qualify for that one next year. Um, we haven't set the dates or any of that, but it's an incredible event where we get to reward the leaders who are taking, you know, who are building the business, who are, you know, stepping out into that role of, of being their own CEO. And it's a time where we do trainings. We lay by the pole, we go out, we stay in. Like it is, it is my favorite week of the year and a chance for me to really love on my team and see the people like one of the girls from Canada, she's been on my team for over two years and I met her for the first time while I was there. Like that was an incredible moment. Another of the girls, she's from Arkansas. I think she's been with me a little over two years and I've met her like four times now. So it's like each time it's like these little mini reunions where you get to see these people that we're so used to seeing each other in little squares and in the challenge group. So it just brings it all to life. Um, there's also the success club trip from Beachbody. I've been to Cancun. I've been on a cruise to the Bahamas and Jamaica, Punta Cana, Riviera Maya. And next year we're going on another cruise and we find out every January where the following years is. But that's something that you could also achieve by hitting success club every month, helping three people every single month. And that's where the success club trip comes from. And there's other leadership ones. I'm getting ready to go to Vegas in two weeks for our corporate leadership, not the leadership that I hosted for my team, but the corporate one. Um, so all sorts of different options there, but from the money, honey, it's commissions from what you sell, um, roughly 25%. But then again, the challenge packs are like 30, 30 to 40%, depending on the, on the bundle. Um, when it comes to getting started, challenge packs, that I just mentioned, those are always what I recommend you start with because there's a $40 sign up fee to enroll as a coach, but that's waived if you get a challenge pack. So it's kind of like, why would you spend $40 on nothing when you can spend $40 
and or you can get the challenge pack and get that wave. It's gonna get you your Shakeology or performance line or both depending on which challenge pack you pick. Um, so it's gonna allow you to begin using the products and sharing it. And then it's also gonna get you the Beach Bunny on demand so you can start exploring the library, trying the different programs. And then there's bundles that include the three day refresh and you, know, you can kind of go on from there. Um, but the challenge pack is always the way that I recommend to get started. There's no annual fees. Um, it's not like you have a one-time membership fee there. There is a monthly coaching fee. It's $15.95. And that's because Beachbody handles all of our inventory, all the customer service, all of the shipping. Like, they do that part. We don't have to hold, hold any of it other than helping people get signed up. You know, we're not actually shipping anything out or anything like that. Like, we're just helping connect them to the right product and Beachbody takes care of that with our paychecks and all of that stuff. So that's the monthly coaching fee. You get a 25% discount on everything that you buy. There's no monthly quota. So like I said in the beginning, I was actually going to be a discount coach where I was purely signing up for the discount and nothing more. Um, and that was okay. But then obviously I changed my mind and went on to build a business. I didn't have to do anything else. Once you're signed up, you're enrolled as a coach. My husband's a coach. He's never done anything with the business. He's just a discount coach. My mother-in-law, same thing. My sister, same thing. But some people build it. So it's just one of those things. My best friend, she's one of my leaders. So you, you have the option of what you do with it once you get signed up. The basic challenge pack with just Shakeology or Performance Line is 160 with the bod and that waves a fee. Or you can get the Performance Line and Shakeology and bod for 220 I didn't list them on there. Um, and then just what to expect as you get started. I do a monthly new coach training. We have a new coach kickoff call next Wednesday night for all of the new coaches. That kickoff call will be I think I have it set for 8 p.m. next Wednesday. And then our new coach training will start the following Monday. So October 1st, next round of new coach training. It's self-paced in a Facebook group. It's something you can log in at any point in time and do. You can go through it at your own pace. You can go through it twice if you want to go through it twice. It doesn't matter. Um, we do team calls every, usually every Monday night. Um, they like, vary if something else is going on. We actually have the CEO on our call, Carl Deichler, on Monday night. Um, and this upcoming Monday, we actually have a guest speaker that's going to speak on our Monday night call. So they can be various topics. They can be motivational. They can be very strategic. They can be monthly planning. They can be social media based. Um, but there's always calls and then our leadership retreat that I mentioned. Um, and just fun. Like, I often think, you know, my daughter, some of you guys know, my daughter had a little injury over the two weeks ago now, a week and a half ago. And I was telling the girls at um, the retreat about this. So I was like, you know, it's crazy when I posted about it, asking for prayers, because we didn't know what was happening with her mouth. We didn't know if there was going to be permanent damage. The people who commented first were people I know through this business. The people who were texting me, asking me how she was doing were people I met through this business. And I sat down with my daughter and we read through everybody's comments and I'm telling her, you know, she's like, who's this person and who's that person? And some she knew and some she didn't. And she said to me, she's like, mommy, I feel so much better because all those people prayed for me. And I thought like it, if I didn't use social media, I would have never posted that. And that conversation would have never been had. And it's those little things that make you realize like, how much of an impact this business can really make in your life and in your family's lives. And like, just like whenever like something happens and I think of who the person I'm going to call, there are people I've met through this business, whether there are people on my team or just people I've just connected with at events. It's because we have that like-minded attitude. They're positive. They're uplifting. They're not competitive. They're empowering. Like that's the people who I want to surround myself with. And that's the people we get on this team. Um, talked a little bit about the different levels and this just goes through whether you want to do this as a discount, whether you want to do this as part-time, whether you want to work towards it being full-time or whether this is going to be your full-time thing. Wherever you are today, it can change tomorrow. Um, but just be aware that there's the different options. Um, as I built my team, I built it on discount coaches. I built it on people who were like, I just want the, the discount, but then those people loved it. And they turned into people who actually wanted to build it just like I was. So I guess kind of like, like attracts, attracts like um, people saw the opportunity and were like, I can do it. I can do it. You do. Um, and it kind of grew from there. Um, just how do you create your business? You know, you're going to commit to a program. That's it. You're sharing your story. I think I've said that countless times already on this call, but it's you doing a program and sharing on it. You have to tell people what you're doing. That public post on Facebook might scare the bejeebies out of you. But once you do that, you're opening the doors to your business. 
people may not interact on it a lot. I remember when I did mine, like nobody said anything, but they started watching. And then when I was able to share my results from the 21 day fix, they were like, you did that in 21 days. Like teach me how. And I was like, okay, I can teach you how. Um, and it's just, you know, we have the training, we have training, countless training. It's there for you, not me. It's there for you to learn from what I've already done and the mistakes I've made. You don't have to recreate the wheel. And if you have someone who's ready to join your team, you add them in there. You don't have to go do it on your own. That's, that's the glory of being on a team, right? Like there's no recreating the wheel. We link arms and we do this together. So it's going to be you thinking about what are your goals? What do you want out of this? Where do you want to go with this business? And then talking together to figure out how we can work and get through there. So the next step as we shine out, this was our theme at our retreat. We shine brighter together. And how true is that? The analogy came from a speech that we had at our summit event where they talked about a firefly. And how one firefly is just like a little flicker of light. Well, if you had a group of fireflies in a room and they all flickered at the same time, how bright that would be. And that's how this business is. We truly, like, you can't do it alone. I can't build a team on my own. That would be no team. Um, but together, we can do so much. So think about it. Um, when you're ready to rock, you know, let me know. Or a coach who invited you to listen to this and we'll help you get started, help you figure out what the best pack or bundle is for you. And just know that it's not easy. There are times where people tell you no. Some of you might tell me no and it doesn't hurt because I'm gonna keep doing my thing. I'm gonna keep going forward. And I always tell my people, my train's moving. I want you on my train if you're ready to run and you're ready to work. I won't stop for you. I'll, I'll slow down if you want to walk on, jump on with me. My train's going, and I would love to have you guys go the whole way with me. So thank you so much for listening to the call. I saw one comment, one chat thing. So if I bought a challenge pack at the end of the summer sale, no. So when you bought that challenge pack, what it's going to do is it you'll have to sign up and pay the $40 fee, but then they'll reimburse you. And it's a simple form, and it's actually pretty quick. So I can shoot you a message and we can talk about that. But signing up, you can just pay the fee. And then the next time you order, you'd become active once you place an order. So that's not a problem at all. Any other questions, guys? But I appreciate you taking the time to tune in and listen. If there's something else that you have, no hesitations. Feel free to shoot me a message, drop me an email, and I look forward to welcoming you officially onto the team here soon. Have a great night, ladies. Good night.